some people on Twitter were speculating you were faking an injury to get a, a, a review going there, but it looked like you know you limped off there. It, what happened? I think you did come back in the game, but. Uh, I, I felt I felt kind of dehydrated. Uh, I knew it was a, a um a serious red zone type of drive, so I didn't really want to put my team in um in a bad predicament when I know uh you know it's, it's other corners that uh, everybody could play. So I kind of felt my my calf tightening up and things like that, and I just I just felt that I didn't want to really try to force it. You know you don't really want to force no injuries. Anything could happen in a critical game like that. So I just. Just decided just to hold it and tell the trainers come get me. Go ahead, Josh. What's practice been like this week? I know you guys talked about focus and kind of refocus a little bit. Have you, you know, I'm on edge. You all are out there a lot. You try to get worn down and get more, you know, you only hold them, you hold them to 20 points. It's not like you necessarily were awful, but just. How do you take what happened last week and turn it into, you know, a positive this week? Uh, for us, we just want to be a consistent defense because we always talk about being a number one defense in the SEC and the nation. So um, we don't really expect to really try to put all the pressure on the offense. So we want, we really want to make the offense um, job more easy. Uh, we just trying to be more consistent out there. We trying to be more focused. Uh, making sure we more doubt then it's another critical East game we gotta win. So and hopefully this game can get us started going for a streak. Okay, Nick Rob. I don't think anybody expected y'all to keep getting five interceptions a game, but is there anything you can do to, to start creating turnovers and helping the offense a little bit when they're struggling? Uh just being in position, um what like like I said, uh consistency. Um, Mizzou game, I feel like we wasn't really consistent in a, in a, in a, a couple of our zone coverages and no one was going on um, like third and medium, third and short and stuff like that. So you, you get interceptions by always just being in the right place at the right time and, and no one was going to go on at that time. So uh, that's what we've been more consistent on in practice. So we go try to really get more turnovers just like the other two weeks. Uh, uh, yeah, uh, we know us getting turnovers, you know, that creates a, a, a wave on, on the game. You know, it helps, it helps our offense get fe better field position. You know, us not getting off the field, that don't, that don't help the offense starting the ball off inside the 20. So, I mean, that's hard for any offense in the SEC, to be honest. And just creating the turnovers, you know, it just, it gets, gets your team hype, gets your defense hype, get everybody create confidence. and. Little do people know when a when a defense get a turnover that also gives the offense confidence to the next time they step on the field. Okay, anything else for Cedric? All right, thank you guys so much. We'll see you tomorrow. Thanks.